Hi pals, coming up on this week's episode of Go With The Heat, Tubbs is a pawn in a battle between two dueling televangelists in the episode Amen, Send Money. On this week in Vice, we'll be taking a look back when this episode of Miami Vice aired from September 28th to October 4th, 1987, when Miami Vice was king. In news, on October 1st at 7.42 a.m., the San Gabriel Valley was awoken by a 5.9 earthquake. The Whittier Narrows earthquake caused over $200 million in damages, with eight people losing their lives in the event. Additional aftershocks took place for days after the main quake, including a 5.2 magnitude on October 4th. Felt across Southern California and Nevada, the blind thrust quake was the first on a fault line unknown to seismologists previously. In music, didn't we almost have it all from Whitney Houston will hold the top spot for one more week so we have to go to the archives. Climbing up the charts and eventually peaking at number 9 is Touch of Grey from The Amazing Grateful Dead. From the album In the Dark, Touch of Grey is the only song from the band that would reach the top 40 in the Billboard Hot 100. The music video gained major traction on MTV throughout 1987 and helped propel the band further into the mainstream. In movies, Fatal Attraction will be at top of the box office for seven more weeks. So we gotta dig a little deeper into the amazing year of the movies that was 1987. I'm torn which to talk about this week with two fantastic movies playing in theaters. The Clive Barker horror classic Hellraiser reached movie theaters last week, not standing a chance against Fatal Attraction. But more important than Hellraiser is the romantic comedy A Princess Bride. Directed by Rob Reiner, the film is based on a classic book of the same name and stars Carrie Yules, Manny Patikin, Andre the Giant, and more. In the world of romantic comedies, there's A Princess Bride, and then there's everything else. Everyone just has to face the facts. The romantic comedy was perfected in 1987 with The Princess Bride. No more rhymes now, I mean it! Anybody want to feel it? Yeah! And that's everything you need to know that was happening when Miami Vice was king. Be sure to join us on Go With The Heat at GoWithTheHeat.com. I'd love to hear from you. Email the show GoWithTheHeat at gmail.com or follow us on Twitter at GoWithTheHeat. That's all for this week. Bye, pals.